So you're in week one. What is a curator? Click right here to go to wakelet.com and open up a Wakelet account. I've already done that. And once you've done that, you can click here to create a new collection. And the first thing to do always is come to the upper right corner over here under private. This is your visibility settings and click unlisted. You can do public it if you want, but at a minimum unlisted. Because if you if this stays in private, when you submit the link, I can't see it, I can't grade it, I can't give you credit for it. So make sure it's on unlisted or public. You can add a cover image if you want. You can upload an image from your computer or choose uh, from, they have a library of images here. Let me see. Uh, oh, that's kind of cool. All right. So you'd come in and title this uh, Week 1 Wakelet. Say that 10 times fast. And then you have uh, options here. Right here with this plus button, if you click on that, the default is to paste in a URL, but say you've taken a picture of one of your bell ringers, you can come over here to the camera icon and image, click right here, and you'll want to do upload an image. So I do upload an image, and here I have the image taking a moment to upload. And once your image, once you've created your first um, entry or post on a Wakelet, come up to Change Layout and make sure you're on Media View. Please don't use any of these other views. Just use Media View. Um, it uh, displays the information in the best manner for this course. Now, once you've posted an image, if you want to, if you need to, there's a little pencil edit button here. Click on that, and then I can say, here is my seashell collection. So I have a photo and I have text. Now, someone asked, what if you've written something in a Word document? Well, we can add so many different things right here, and a Word document is unfortunately not one of them but you can add text. So say, for example, you had written something in a Word document, this is just one of my syllabi, that I can click on Add Text and then just paste in my writing. So that's one way of doing it. The other option would be you can upload a PDF. And if you aren't familiar with it, that I'm going back to Microsoft Word now, that I can go up to File, Save As, and when I come down here to Format, I can do Save As PDF. Now I've already saved this document as a PDF, but um, you could save it as a PDF, so then when you come back to your Wakelet, you can click on Upload PDF and you could upload your PDF that way. So anyway, whenever you're done with your week one wakelet, come up here in the upper right corner. Please make sure to do this. And once you've pressed done, you can double check your work, and then you would take this link and submit it in the assignment for your week one wakelet. <laughs> week one wakelet. Now, what about the museum collection? So let's come back here. You'll create a museum collection okay and in the assignment for this first one I ask you to go to the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York and you know just with search this collection I can search for anywhere but I'm I, I just popped in Chile so I'd found this before, and this is an ear ornament of a winged runner, which is just, just stupendous from, uh, you know, uh, AD 
400 to 700. So whenever you post some artwork, I want the title, your ornament, I want the date. And this looks like here, it's moche, which is um, uh, a type of people that, um, uh, a tribe. And so we don't have the artist's name, but we have a tribe or a location or a people. So that uh, works. Whoops, I don't need that quite yet. Sorry. <laughs> I need to take this link. Here's the URL to this artwork. Click right here. Whoops, made the big mistake. First things first. Make sure your museum collection is unlisted. Bing, 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 bing. Um, then I'll paste in that URL. And double check that you're on media view. Okay. Now, I already started doing this earlier. I was a little premature, but I've selected this information right here. Let me double check, I've got it. Select this information. Hover my cursor over my Wakelet post to get to this little pencil edit button. Come in and paste this in. So it has the title, it has the date, and in this case, uh, the, the people who created it. And so in some cases, you might just have to put unknown artist if there isn't any indication. But remember, title of the work, date of creation, the artist who created it, or the, the people or region of the world that it came from. Now, say for example, you're posting an, an image for one assignment, you'll need to post an image and then write about it, that after you've put in the details like this, you can come back to edit and I can, and then you can just start writing right here and say, this ear ornament is incredible, incredible. Well, whatever you wanna, whatever you wanna write, but that's a way that you can go in there and uh, do some writing along with a link that you present. Um, and so, just before you submit, before you're done, make sure it's unlisted, make sure you're in media view, and then you can click done. And so what's good here is when I, if I click on this, it'll take me right to the museum, because we want to make sure we give credit to where we got that information from. Whoops. So then this is my museum collection. I come back to the assignment, click to open it up. I already showed you in class how to do this, so I'll just come over here to start new. Scroll down, click on write submission, click on the three dots. I always want to put in some text before you put in the link. Paste in that link. Click right here, come up to my link, edit link, open link in, new window. Boom. Click submit. And then just double check your link to make sure it opens in a new window. And there we go, right to the museum collection. All right, there you have it. Have fun.